Welcome to the homestead, everyone. Um, this is kind of a continuation of a video that I started a long time ago, last year. Actually, two years ago. This is the second winter that this has been on. But uh, I'm not sure if I lost the video clips or if I didn't finish recording it or what, but uh, we're going to go through really quickly and talk about our skirting on the travel trailer. So what we have here is the one and a half inch uh, foil lined skirting. Um, well, it's foil lined insulation. It's the styrofoam insulation. Uh, I'm going to be going through making some repairs, obviously, you know, a little bit that came apart. But basically, we'll go over here, I'll show you a couple of things here. So here is basically what I did. The furnace is just shutting off, so you're probably hearing that. I took um, reclaimed wood. This is from, you know, the lawn pallets or skids, whatever you want to call them. And I basically just made a frame. Now. All of this is, <clears throat> excuse me, all of this is just spray foamed in here and that's all that's up in there. So that way when it comes time to move the travel trailer, it'd be fairly easy to cut and we can just move all this stuff out of the way. But uh, you can pretty much see what I did. I took panels, cut them to size and I put uh, the spray foam insulation, I see I didn't do a very good job. This is the reason why I'm doing a repair on here. There's actually, yeah, you see it there. On the other side, what happened is we had a 50 mile an hour windstorm come through and it blew that open. And actually it looks like a bigger piece than I thought is missing. So I'll be crawling under there looking for more. But there's that piece, and then this piece here. And I just uh, foamed it to, you know, act kind of like a glue. It's snug up against the ground <clears throat> to try to keep minimum air in there. And it's actually worked really, really well. I'll go back over here. I'm gonna pull this here. This is the access for the dump tanks. Um, it's well used, so it's not even sitting in there the right way anymore. All right, so that's what this thing looks like. It just sits inside the frame there. You know, dump tanks. My original plan, I'm hoping to get some weather stripping and just put a little weather stripping around here. That'll help seal this area off because even with this insulation, this still freezes. Um, it doesn't freeze near as much. I mean, I'm really, really impressed. Uh, last year, I think it was in February, we actually had some temperatures that dropped down to negative seven overnight, and it actually froze. <clears throat> and um, you can see, uh, yeah, you can see what that is. That's a that's heat tape there, and have a little Walmart 250 watt heater there. So we can run the generator and we can get this thing to stay defrosted. I've got a couple of them wound around there. But that one there, that is the gray tank and it has a lot longer run. So that's why the heater is there and not here. And plus this is a lot thicker that it's more difficult for this to freeze than it is for this. Since that hose is so, or that pipe is so small, it's a lot easier for it to freeze. So I got the heater by it, just to try to keep it defrosted. When we run the generator, we, I just automatically plug in this uh, green extension cord here. So that pretty much takes care of that. Uh, but uh, last year when it was down to negative seven, it did actually freeze. We had to bring in a external propane heater and blow the heat in there. Um, 
that week is coming up here probably within two or three weeks i looked at the weather it's supposed to not get above freezing for an entire week which is a lot warmer than last year but you know better safe than sorry got to repair that section over there but uh, here we go I'll see if i can just maybe take you along on the uh on the repair all i'm really going to do is i got some uh spray foam insulation i've never used this stuff i've always used the stuff it says uh great stuff on the front this is the uh, ge version i know we'll see how well it does I and mean, it's really cold so i don't know if it's even really gonna cure i've got the two pieces here this piece is it this side yeah this piece is this side this piece is the other. We have to take a good look. That opening on the other side seems a bit big for just this one piece. And as you can see, it's the foil lined. We keep the foil inside, so that way any heat that is in there gets reflected in. All right, let's see what we can do here. All right, so. The battery on the camera is already starting to get low. It's pretty cold out here, so if any of you out there have your own YouTube channels and you work with cameras or anything battery powered, you know that uh, cold kind of zaps the battery. So we're going to see what we can do. If it stops recording while I'm down there, then oh well. I'll just talk to you afterwards. Man, it's going to be a tight fit. Always do it on my own, so I gotta get through it And the only thing I know is to love what I'm doing Never give up, never slow, till I finally prove it Never listen to the no's, I just wanna keep moving Keep my head up when I act, head up, that's a fact Never looking back, I'ma keep myself on track Keep my head up, staying strong, always moving on Feel I don't belong, tell my thoughts to move along Push myself to be the best, die with no regrets Okay, we're actually looking okay. I don't know if you can even see this, I'm not seeing the camera. There we go. Right. I was wondering what happened to that old can. <coughs> And I see, this is how the cat's been getting underneath there. So, not quite sure what to do about this gap here, that's not good. Pain in the butt cat. And then 
I'm not sure exactly why I have this thing here, but that'll go over there where the cat's been getting in. Everything else down here it looks pretty good. Over here. See that? Yeah, it's a pretty big freaking gap. Yeah. 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 Show that there to that side. Yeah. A bunch of straw. Show it here. here. survive for that. So we'll just go ahead and do this section here and then we'll go ahead and uh, there's a couple other spots like that corner sticking out. Uh, that area back there. Get my thumb back that way. Go ahead and do that. Hope I'm talking loud enough to let you hear over the furnace. Just this. You know, it's a good and bad thing about this stuff. It doesn't stick all that well. So it's good for the fact that if you want to move it at some point in time, but it's bad because it's not really like glue in case you want to go like glue. was going to be a more permanent thing, which well, it might be. Um, I would actually cover this up. I'll just make it look better because, as you can see, it degrades and looks like crap. I think I pulled this one out on purpose a while ago because it smelled like the kitten thought something was dead on. So. To make sure it wasn't under here. It got me feeling like a weak spot in my head, and I asked myself to please stop. Take a breath, need to get all of these deep thoughts out my head. Yeah, I just want to be known, I just want to be home. Feel like I'm all alone, and I need to do it. Right. I just want to be known, I just want to be home. Feel like I'm all alone, and I need to do it. I'm gonna come apart yeah. here, so I'm yeah, yeah. I love to do it. Yeah. Got some down inside behind it. Now, considering this has been here for over a year, this is really all the upkeep I've had to do. It's doing pretty well. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah, I don't wanna feel the pain no more. I just wanna make a change, restore humanity. The sanity is leaving for the vanity. I plan to be close to my family. Hold it nice and tight. And go to the next section. This is the section here I showed you. Beginning of the video. So I'm basically just gonna do the same thing. Be right here, going up. In my bed, got me feeling like a weak spot. Down. In my head, and I ask myself to please stop. Take a breath, need to get all of these deep thoughts out my head. Yeah, right there. I just want to be known. I just want to be home. Feel like I'm all alone, right. and I need to do it on my own. I just want to be known. I just want to yeah, be home. Me. Feel like I'm all alone, and I need to do it on my own. Yeah, all right. Let me take a quick look at the rest of it. I think I saw a gap in here that I wanted to close up. All right, so there we go, everyone. Battery's gonna die on the camera. So a nice short video. Um, I may or may not use video clips from the last one, but uh, there you go, you got the idea. And I filled it in around the steps there. Once again, I may put skirting over it because that does look ugly. But uh, if you like this video and want to see more, go ahead and uh, hit that subscribe button, do the thumbs up, you know, share it if you know somebody who could use this information. Until next time, keep kicking up dust.